So I'm here in Avalon, New Jersey, and uh, just came over here from Stone Harbor, where a buddy of mine has a place, and spent a couple of days just chilling out here. But I thought this would be a good spot to uh, make my announcement. Um, kind of gave it away in the title, but uh, before I do uh, get into the details, I uh, wanted to give a shout out to a guy who had a lot to do with getting me into uh, 4x4 trails and uh, getting this Jeep and doing cross-country overlanding trips and uh, his handle on YouTube is Super Wheelie I think. I'll put a link down below. Uh, he's a French guy who's been here since the late 90s in this country and uh, loves this place as much as I do. Um, his videos are amazing and on his last five-week trip which he just got back from uh, he took uh, or he bought a drone and so he's got some really cool videos out there with drone footage and uh, his own camera footage and things like that and it's definitely worth checking out um, if you like uh, looking at cross-country trip videos and uh, seeing what people are doing out there. He's taken a TJ and converted it into uh, something that he can live in um, including with a bed and, uh, and a small kitchen and, and things like that so check him out. So anyway, um, as my title suggested, I am uh, quitting my job, which happens to be uh, in the corporate world, and I've decided to call it quits um, for at least a while, hopefully. Um, maybe it'll be a complete life change. Uh, the idea is to try to take off for at least a year and have most of that time be out on the road going cross-country from... North Carolina and possibly down to Texas over to California, um, maybe even end up in South Dakota, Wyoming, and Montana again, and uh, then point towards Alaska and get this thing to Alaska. So it's, uh, it's quite a big change. Um, some people think I'm crazy for doing it. Uh, other people have been really supportive. Uh, there have, of course, been a lot of WTF, are you thinking? Um, giving up a, a good corporate gig with uh, a lot of vacation it pays well um, but it's just I'm, I'm kind of over it and I, I want to see what else is out there um, I want to start living even more for adventure and uh, this could be a good one or a bad one I don't know time will tell um, but it, it's not like I'm leaving or quitting next week um, my team knows, my company now knows, so uh, the cat's out of the bag, and so I thought it'd be a good time to post the video, but I'm actually, um, it, it's going to be another three to five months. It's October, and I'm, I'm shooting to end in March 1st, and that's it, uh, but truth is, anything after January when I get back from holiday is game. It, it just depends on what my mindset is and, and whether or not I want to hang in there for another couple of months, but... The more I hang in there, the more money I can save. And, and by January, I should have enough to pay for my house to keep that for a year. And then the other thing will be, you know, putting gas in this thing because uh, it's not cheap, um, especially uh, if I'm going to be driving a lot rather than uh, staying in places for a long period of time. And then I'm going to have to have uh, money for incidentals like fixing this thing and, and whatever else may come up. So that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm going to live the life of a nomad, hopefully, uh, for a good six to nine months of that time period, maybe longer. Um, it'd be great if I could find a seasonal job somewhere, something that I really liked, uh, especially out in Alaska. Um, get a little bit of income. It doesn't have to pay a lot. I just got to like doing what I'm doing. Um, and then after the year's up, I don't know, maybe if, if I can figure out a way to, to, to stay on the road um, or to travel a lot more in this uh vehicle then then that would be great um, but uh, I'm at the point in my life where I just want to try something big and if it doesn't work I'm, I'm still young enough that I can do a 180 and, and get back into maybe another corporate gig at a smaller scale company um, or just find something else that's gonna pay the bills I, I don't plan on having a lot of expenses I plan on minimizing those uh, more than I already have uh, so that I can live this life um, I'm only keeping the house because uh, who knows what's going to happen. And without a job, it's going to be hard to buy another one. So uh, that way I'll have a place that I can go back to if this doesn't work out. And then if it does, then I'll decide what I'm going to do with it after the year. So anyway, the, the people that um, are supporting me, there are the important ones in my life. So that's pretty good. And um, 
just see how it goes. But uh, this is this is my Cherokee. This is my XJ. That's what I'll be living in uh, for the most part. Um, I'm still going to go on my trip to Nova Scotia and Newfoundland in, uh, or over the Christmas holiday. So that's still on the cards. And then the rest of it, it'll just be, you know, doing, doing my job in, until the end. And it'll probably require a lot of travel. And then uh, in between there, doing what I can to, to prepare. Um, and then once I take off, I'll probably stay home for about a month and, and really get everything in order. Uh, make sure this thing has everything that I need done to it so that I don't have to worry about too much when I'm out on the road. So anyway, um, that's it. Uh, leave your comments below. I'll probably do a follow-up video with uh, some questions that people have and, and get into more details about this or that or, you know, whatever's on your mind. Um, so... That's what's going to happen. I'm excited about it, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the like button.